take that last picture of. You are sorry? I'd like to I'd like for you to take the last picture of. Off? Because yeah, you didn't ask us. Oh you mate. Ask our no, 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 no. You're asked in public. I was yeah. taking a photo of that building yeah. there downstairs. Mate, back off. Yeah, but I don't know what you did, man. Don't fuck off, man. You got a camera? So what? Can you tell him fuck off? You probably sat under one there. I'm sorry, man, but you can... Uh, no, uh, hang on, I'll show you. Do everything about it. Hang on. Yeah, let me see that picture. Hang on, I'll show you. Yeah, that's all you got to do, man. Where are you in that? Right there. So what? So what? You can you can zoom in? Why would I? You, Why you would I? You got rights? Why would I? You got rights? Yeah, do you know the, the law on photography? You got rights? Rights? Yeah, you got rights to take a picture of me. Oh, you got rights to sit around drinking alcohol. You got rights to fucking take a picture of me, motherfucker. It's got nothing to do with you. What you got on you, my fucking hands, man? Because of people like you. Yeah. Yeah, yes. Taking fucking pictures of me. Because I'm minding my own business, doing photography. You're taking fucking pictures. I'm of me not taking people. a photo of you, am I? What's on the camera? That building, that building. But I don't give two tosses you can, about you. Can you can zoom me in. Why would I? You can zoom me in. Why would I? I'm a fucking uh, one of ten fucking most wanted. No, you're not. I've yes, never heard of you. But well, why out in public but barefaced? I but I am. That's why I'm asking you to fucking take that picture. So I'm not again. going to. Can you do that without me? No. Can you take the picture again without me in it? But why? Do you need it? Right. I'm right. I'm memorising you now. Yeah. What's the difference between a camera and that? Yeah. See. Just mate, just leave me alone. Go and do your thing. So, uh, no. Uh, this is a violation of fucking... Uh, right, if you're going to carry on, I'll just call the police. Violation? If you just carry on, I'll just call the police. Go ahead. There's no other way to do, do this. Violating fucking my fucking No, no, no. Rights, man. Your rights, if you're out in public, there's no ex expectation of privacy. Is it? Right, you shouldn't be drinking alcohol in public. That's another one. What's drinking alcohol in public? You're drinking alcohol in public, no, no, aren't you? It wasn't. I wasn't drinking when you took a picture of it. You clearly are all drinking. No, I am. I saw you. I thought, right, I won't take a photograph of that building because it's too close up. I know what you were doing. I'll go up there, I'll photograph this building and that one in the background. Uh, I know what you're doing. No, you don't? Yes, I do. Why, are you in my mind? No, I know what you're doing. What am I doing? I'll tell no, you what, there's nothing, tell, there's tell nothing, me what, there's stop coming so close then. to me as well. Right, tell me what I'm doing then. What, 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 what am I doing? doing? You tell me what I'm doing. I know you're trying to be a punisher. A what, sorry? Punisher. Punisher? Yeah. What for, do you mean? For some reason, a, a, a punisher, you know, the comic uh, comic book uh, person, eh? A punisher, eh? No, I don't. Look, look, look what you got. Because, without being rude, people like yourself come up to me when I'm out in public, minding my own business, doing photography, when you walk past God knows how many cameras every single day, there's probably even a camera looking at us right now. Yeah, okay, is. do you do anything about that? Or do you just go up to members of the public minding your own business doing yeah, photography? So, so we're, we're I have to wear these because of people like you that bother me. It's me. Well, not you're not doing too bad. Sometimes people get very aggressive. Yeah. You're. Thank you. Okay. So what's going to happen now? I'm going to wait there for a train because that's the next photo I'm going to take, and then I'm off. Yeah. I'm, the camera's going to be facing that way. If you're that concerned about. Man, but I'm, I'm concerned about that, man, because people will look at that, man. But I have to, because I've had people call, call me a paedophile, I've had people accuse me of all sorts. So I have to wear these gloves to protect myself. Okay? okay? So I, I don't know your story, yeah? I don't know why. Yeah, but I just mind, you. without being rude, you, yeah? without being careful, rude, yeah? just mind your business. Right, Good. I'm mind, if, you, if you're that concerned, the police are there. Okay? All right? In the future, just leave people be. Okay, and if you're that bothered about cameras, when you go into a supermarket to buy beer or whatever, yeah. ask them why they're filming you. Yeah, but, but uh, I haven't met, met too many people like that, man. What, I'm, what I mean to say Well, I'm is, just, a, I just, just, what, what mate, I'm just a street photographer. Right, yeah. I'm photographing old buildings that are falling apart and disappearing. But well, you're, not, you're, not, you're not in, a, in a, any trouble or anything like that? Me? Yeah. No, no. Are you? No. Oh, there you go. We're all good. Okay, mate. Where's your accent from, by the way? Uh, uh, 20 years in, uh, in the States. All right. Yeah. I'm, I'm originally from Poland, but when I was a kid, I went there. And, uh, Do you know what I was going to say to you? You know, when you came up to me, I was going to I was going to say, Shaprasham, me Maui Angliski. Oh, come on. Me will me, Jen Dobre. Yeah, me will me, Jen Dobre. Okay, mate, I hope you're all your best. Yeah. All I'm going to do, I'm just going to wait there, photograph you, the train. You're okay, man. You're, okay? you're fine, man. I'm down there, I'll just ask okay, you about a picture, man. Don't worry. Yeah, that's all you, it was, I'm not man. concerned about you. It's that, it's that building I'm photographing. All right. Yeah. Enjoy your day, buddy. Enjoy your day.
Go ahead, Tom. So today I visited the dreaded Luton and somewhere I've heard many horror stories about and I have to say it wasn't that bad. I actually had quite a nice day. Um, the for the for the record that was the final photo on the A6 after I've ever photographed so I've photographed everywhere, all the way from Luton through Derbyshire up to Lancashire and all the way up to Carlisle. So the photos I've got I'll compile into a book and if there is such a thing as a, an A6 society, let me know if you're interested in seeing it. Um, so the backstory to that little video there, um, there's some people drinking outside one of the old hat factories, I think it might have been, near the railway tavern for anyone who is to town. And you know, it's the usual people you find outside job centres and so on, just drinking, you know, like special brew and so on throughout the day. And I thought, I'll, I'll play the game, I'll back off, I'll move further up the hill uh, and photograph, you know, like down the street a good distance away. I think I must have been about 100 metres away. And anyway, he bloody come up and, you know, obviously started, he, as you saw, he wasn't kicking off, but he was just kind of concerned. But bloody hell, that level of paranoia to come 100 metres away and ask for a photo to be deleted. And he wasn't even actually, you couldn't actually even see him in the photo because he had his hand covering his face. I'm surprised he could even see that far as that far away. Um, but the reason why I blurred his face is that I, I do have a code with these people. Like, I understand the concern, I can respect it. But as I say, you know, if you're that concerned, you need to be asking every single supermarket why they're filming you, where your data's going. And um, and to be honest, we had a good chat off camera uh, later on as well outside the railway tavern, and he was a good bloke. You know, I, I don't want to embarrass him. So the only reason I've really uploaded the video is just to show other street photographers, you know, like perhaps how to deal with it. Because I think I dealt with it fairly well, to be honest. Um, considering how I was four or five years ago, that would have just terrified me, and I would just caved in and deleted it. Um, but um, yeah, he's, he was a good guy. I've got nothing against him, and you know I've got no intentions to embarrass him, and that's why I've made sure I covered him up. Um, but yeah, that's it. Cheers.